Traffic, it is tied up on Lakeshore Drive after a trailer overturned happened around 2 this afternoon in the southbound lanes of Lakeshore. A streets and sanitation truck was uh, carrying a large piece of equipment on a trailer when that trailer overturned. No one was injured, though. Traffic is slow because of that accident. So let's go to WGN's Jim Ryan in the traffic center to help uh, walk us through this. Lourdes, I'll tell you what, it's pretty bad. Uh, as you just mentioned, this crash happened around 2 o'clock, and that means Lakeshore Drive has been closed on that southbound side for over three hours now. I just got off the phone with uh, Police Media Affairs. Still no estimate on when this is going to reopen. Like you said, turned over truck right around Walton. The closure actually starts around Fullerton and Lincoln Park. From there, uh, traffic is being diverted off and uh, back on at Chicago Avenue near downtown. So huge stretch for a closure. And because of this, the southbound delay starts at Montrose. Pretty much a parking lot, that entire side of Lakeshore Drive. Complicating things for a time, we had a separate crash on the northbound side of Fullerton. The good news is that has cleared up, so northbound Lakeshore Drive actually improved. But again, that southbound side just continues to get worse, and that's actually having a residual effect because it's backing up the inbound Kennedy as well as the inbound Edens here, which you can see a crash on the Edens at Caldwell really not helping things. Check out your travel times. Kennedy Expressway, an hour 20 from O'Hare. If you're headed in from the airport, you may want to consider Milwaukee Avenue or Ogden instead. As for uh, Lakeshore Drive, again, no uh, estimate on when that southbound side will reopen. Back to you, Lourdes. Okay, slow go. Thank you for that.